following unboxing has been paid for by the CCC. Captivating, charismatic, copper bearded, for life. Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Mick Bailey and I am your captivating, charismatic, copper bearded ginger and I am back with another... What? Who are you? You want, you want what? Mate, I can't hear you. I'm, I'm trying to do a wrestle crate unboxing for my YouTube followers. You, you want? But there's no need for language like that. What? What do you want? You want what? Just hey, get off! Ah! Wait, what do you think you're doing? Hey, you can't. Ah! Ah! Get down! Ah! Get with the old and in with the cool. I am the existential thinking, craft beer drinking, beard growing, cloud blowing, king of the hipsters, Sick Mick Bailey. And from now on, I'm going to be doing all of these Wrestle Crate unboxings because that chump has got an embarrassing view count on his videos. So I'm going to add some hipster flair to each and every one of these videos and find out what peng items are inside this month's crate. So before I go off and have a coffee in an unusual receptacle, let's have a look what they've given us this month. So first of all, we have the catalogue of goods and it's got Sugar Dunkerton on the front. Now, if you ask me, reading is so 2017, but if you want to have a look through that, you do it at your own leisure. It's got info for days, bruv. For days. So let's see all about the good stuff, shall we? So we've got some sort of uh, independent wrestling on demand trial. I hope that is ethically sourced cardboard. I'm sure it is because I wouldn't have it any other way. But there's... There's a good bit of artwork on the front there. Masters of the Universe, that's so retro, bruv. I love it. But yeah, on the back there, we've got wrestling on demand, independent wrestling, and that is sick AF. Next up, we've got a sticker, and it is the mayor of Slamtown himself, Johnny Nitro, Mundo, whatever you want to call him, really. But that's got the sick Sick graffiti style there of something a bit Fresh Prince of Bel-Air-esque. And again, that is retro and peng. Next up, we've got what we got here. This is a DVD. Man, I'm more about the Blu-rays and the streaming nowadays. But, you know, it's all good still. And there we have wrestling on the edge of the world. Now, could you imagine doing that? I couldn't because... I'm a bit more of an existential thinking sort of person. I'm questioning whether or not my life is real, if this reality is real, what happens outside in a different universe. But when I'm not doing that, I will probably be watching this DVD. Some good matches on the back there, of course. And obviously there's Travis Banks and he is sick, bruv. He is sick. Next up we've got, it is a Johnny Impact Slam Town badge. Liking that. Again, got the sick graffiti finish on it. Really feeling that. That looks good. I might put that on one of my charity shop blazers. And probably my favourite one as well, because I really like that. That is sick. Next up, we have a CD. And it's the music of Hot Tag. A CD, bruv. I didn't even know they made these anymore. But nevertheless, there's the music of Pete Dunne on there. To Neil Dashwood. Flash Morgan Webster, he thinks he's a bit of a hipster, but he ain't got nothing on me. But there's some good music on there, bruv, and I'll probably put that on my portable streaming device and have a listen to it when I'm riding my penny farthing. Next up, we've got, it's a magazine and it's from those nerds at WrestleTalk, but they do do a good wrestling magazine. Again, I'm hoping this paper is ethically sourced and probably gluten-free, otherwise I won't read it. And if it's in my possession, I can assure you that it is gluten-free, 100%. I don't, I don't feel like I'm bloating right now, bro. I feel sick AF. Moving along next, we have, it's a signed picture of Sugar Dunkerton. And look at that, that is awesome, blood. Love it, blah, awesome. And there was he put, super fly like super dry. 
brother can rhyme just like me. That is awesome. And next up we've got, it's a little boxy with a fine looking honey on the front. It's the Session Moth Martina. Let's open up the box. I'm hoping that this box is lactose free. Otherwise I'll be feeling a little bit under the weather in the morning if you know what I'm saying. Now have a look at that, would you? That is fantastic. It's got the lips, it's got the brows, it's got the high pony, it's even got a can in its hand, and that is Peng AF. Bible, bruv. And last but not least, we've got a little bit of flair for all you hipsters out there. It is the Hangman Page t-shirt, and that is Retro AF, bruv, because it has mad vibes of the Cactus Jack variety. Awesome. Now, I like to believe that this cotton here is ethically sourced. It has to be, otherwise I would not wear it, bruv. But that is Peng, yeah! So there you have it, a selection of stuff, bruv. Love it, love it. And I have been the existential thinking, craft beer drinking, beard growing, cloud blowing, king of the hipsters, Sick Mick Bailey. Yeah.